for development to occur normally. Typically, not only are specific genes required, but the proper levels of these genes. And so therefore, if any genetic accidents, particularly chromosomal changes, cause duplications of sections of genes or deletions of chromosomal regions and their genes, this would then affect gene dosage. It would affect the amount of gene product an embryo would produce. And if the difference is great enough, this could threaten the development of the individual, the survival of the individual after birth, or decrease their viability. Since homologous chromosomes align during uh, meiosis and matching sections of chromosomes undergo synapsis, any chromosomal changes which would then make this less likely could potentially affect the fertility of the offspring. And so inversions, which take chromosomal regions and reinsert them at a 180 degree angle, or translocations, which move chromosomal sections to different chromosomes. This would affect the pairing of chromosomes during meiosis and thus more and more offspring of a, a hybrid individual would undergo miscarriage or would fail to develop because they would receive duplications of some genes, deletions of other genes, and this would affect fertility. And so as two populations are separated and chromosomal and other genetic differences accumulate between the two populations, at some point it is typical that this begins to affect both the viability and fertility of any hybrid offspring between these two populations. At some point, the offspring may not be capable of viability or fertility, and these two populations are now, now recognized as distinct species.